Good Monday afternoon to you. Meteorologist Chris Johnson here with a check of your fast cast. We had some rain showers early on. The good news is plenty of sunshine expected to break out through this afternoon. That's going to lead to a clear and cold night and then the chance for some strong, even severe thunderstorms come into play as wet into your Tuesday afternoon and Tuesday evening. And here's the setup. We had that cold front come through earlier on this morning. That's working off towards the eastern coast. That's eventually going to clear the eastern coast as we head into this afternoon, this evening. A cold front will pass to our north, but no impacts expected from that. But the system spinning across the central plains, that's a different story. Going to bring some snowfall across the Great Lakes region. That's also going to lift a warm front here across the Commonwealth as temperatures soar into the low, even mid 60s for highs into your Tuesday afternoon. And then notice what happens as this low pressure system moves eastward along with its attended cold front. That's going to bring a line of some showers along with a few embedded thunderstorms. And some of these storms could be on the stronger, even severe side. The threat for heavy rainfall, damaging winds, even some hail will be possible. Now that system will quickly move through. That's going to leave some cloud cover across the Commonwealth as wet into your Wednesday morning and Wednesday afternoon. And then we'll eventually clear things out into Wednesday evening. But we do have a slight risk for all of central and eastern Kentucky. The threats once again being that heavy rainfall, gusty to damaging winds and some hell. So something we'll continue to monitor here in the Sky Alert Weather Center. Seven day forecast where your weekend is always in view. Lower 60s once again for your Tuesday. We're cooling things off late week with the chance for a few snowflakes and then we're drying out just in time for Saturday and Sunday with plenty of sunshine and highs rebounding into the mid to upper 50s.